every career, especially military and paramilitary, promotion is an elixir to more dedication and better performance. The Police Service Commission has approved the appointment of Assistant Inspector General AIG Olukayode Egbetoku as the Deputy Inspector General of Police DIG, who will be representing the Southwest Zone. DIG Egbetoku will be replacing DIG Johnson Babatunde Kokumo, who retired on the 15th of March. The Commission <laughs> also approved the promotion of 24 commissioners of police to the next rank and assistant inspector general of police, including the commissioner of police in charge of Ogun State, Frank Mba, the former commander of the Rapid Response Squad, RRS, in Lagos, Olatunji Desu, is among the 33 officers promoted to the rank of commissioner of police. Jide, I spoke with one commissioner of police in Adamawa, and he told me that the submits for any police, what the government is owing you, mm -hmm. is to get to the rank of police commissioner of police. Mm -hmm. Now, if you now go ahead to AIG, DIG, that is a political appointment. That means, mm -hmm. you yeah. know, God <laughs> is really yeah, on your, your side. side and mm -hmm. So, congratulations to the likes of Frank Uba. Frank Uba is not six months in Ogun State. Mm -hmm. <laughs> he has been promoted to that early squad. <laughs> AIG, Inspector, Assistant Inspector General of Police, mm -hmm. and our own dear friend, um, RRS, uh, mm -hmm. this too, from RRS to the, uh, yeah. what do they call it? Uh, is that uh, IRT? IRT, yes. IGP response team, Olatunji Disu, now a full-blown commissioner of police. Yes, it's a uh, thing of joy to me and uh, to see people that we had always um, um, been happy with because mm -hmm. of their dedicated. dedication of joy. You know, um, Someone like Frank Kumba, when he, uh, he was um, brought to Lagos mm -hmm. the first time as uh, a spokesperson, police, 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 he police. distinguished himself. Yeah. Yes. Distinguished himself and then was taken to Abuja so, to PRO. become first PRO. Came back again, you know, to do that job. It's, it's, it's a measure of the quality that he has for, for different IGs. They always consider want to bring him, him back. good. Even when the enough. rank was above, they yes. want to bring him back. As <laughs> and you know, he then became somebody training police PROs, the mm. PPROs uh, at, at state level. He became the, the person training them at the, at the uh, academy. So to see him rise to the rank of AIG. Is, uh, is the blessing of God, and it mm. is testament to his hard work, mm. uh, inventiveness, and mm. uh, capacity. Mm. In everything, capacity shines through. Mm. If you do not have capacity, even if you have integrity and you have honesty, mm. you don't have enough. Mm. You must have capacity, because this that is... capacity is what will take you further in your chosen career. Mm. Because in this, this is a demo, this, this, the job that they do, the policeman's job, is a demonstrable job. Mm. If you are good at it, people yes. will know. Yes. Your track record will show that you are good. Mm. Policemen, especially those of them uh, who are uh, of the operations cadre, um, um, for example, those of them in, uh, in the operations line, mm. the number of arrests they make, convictions and the rest, Stand them out. It's, so their KPI is is uh, the, uh, the, 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 the their competence is measured by the number of arrests they make. If you say you are an operations person in the police, and you are not a hands-on police officer, and you are not making enough arrests, look at Ed Gall when he was here. Edgar was a proper police operations person, and even in the night he would lead. Is is uh, juniors mm. to go and raid mm. criminals hideouts. In Lagos, we he enjoy doing it. Good, wonderful CPs. Yes, Look he enjoy the, doing it. And the, sometimes it would it would even just like uh, the man the, that went to Odumosu. 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 will carry the... out raids in the night. Mm. You won't know that is actually that the CP he can he can decide to move around in the night and catch policemen who are misbehaving. That's what Dumo so for you. And AIG before he left. Huh? Yes, mm -hmm. you know, just before his mm -hmm. retirement, mm -hmm. uh, they, they gave him that uh, that uh, rank. So, I'm happy that 
people who have done well are being rewarded. Look at Egberto Kuntu, mm -hmm. who was in Kwara. DIG. Yes, he was here in Lagos. He was the same, same CP in Kwara. Mm -hmm. He too now is the one to represent the Southwest now uh, amongst the DIG. So the police is, um, they impress me by the way they go after the back decks in their ranks. Mm. They also impress me by the way they reward hard work. But the war against the bad eggs, the black legs <laughs> in the police must continue. Because it is those bad legs mm. that are Want destroying to, the good name of the, of the embass, yes. of the head girls, yes. of the people who are the shining mm. lights mm. of our police, the mm. dissus of this world. Yes, they yes. need to purge the force of those criminals mm. wearing police uniform, uh, uh, extorting money from mm. criminals, mm. and then taking their lives after mm. taking all the mm. money from them. Look mm. at what happened in Anambra State, for example. Not good we, can't, we can't continue we, to like, allow that to happen. Mm. There is a, a video now of some policemen torturing a woman. They removed her, her bra and left her breast dangling, and they were just flogging her. Mm. Why should we have people in the police who are still behaving like that despite the answers? Uh, uh, protests. Mm. It means that uh, the people who are still wearing police uniform, whose conduct, whose idiosyncrasies bring them to the level of animals, mm. they are still remaining in the force. I and think, we need to purge them. I think largely we have to blame the rank and file. And the process of recruiting this rank and yes, files. Exactly. When you see people that no, never do well in the society, arm robbers in the society, or retired arm robbers. I think it's the society. recruitment. Uh, yes. In my experience with the police, even as a journalist, I've discovered that when you meet senior officers, they attend to you very well. Mm. You, know, you can walk to a DPO. Mm. You know, I've had that experience. No, if you see some civilians, yes. if you see. There are some senior <laughs> officers who are. Next to animals. I agree. I agree uh, with you. Also, but what we are talking about in uh, in uh, in Anambra is it other ranks that are guilty? Well, mm. but check but now. You I see, have you seen, in, in, my people. in my own experience, I have seen very good senior officers, but most of the most of the atrocities are perpetrated by those ones that are on the road. And the, the truth of the matter is, they, they need to look into the mode of recruitment. Who are mm. the people? Are we recruiting people who are failures, who are frustrated, people who couldn't catch, make their own level? You know. And then they've tried every other thing. And they now see police as a, a, police as a dumb site. Robbers, arm robbers in their robbers. communities. Mm -hmm. they, exactly. They just, they then do we do background check on the people? Do they do background check on the people they are recruiting? Mm. You know, those are some of the questions they need to ask. You can't keep looking at the one he described now, treating, subjecting a woman to such mm. level of indignity. The video, it doesn't your, make sense. You have, to be, you have to be mad and idiotic mm. for you to do that kind of thing. You are not a human. You are not a human. And they were tying her hand behind her back. You know, they removed her top completely. The bra was gone. Now, why would you go to that extent with a woman? Anywhere outside of this country that they see such a video, they are going to conclude that we are animals here. Honestly, and it makes no sense. And if someone is a civilian who told them to do that, policemen should not just at the, at, at the I mean, after being given money, just simply forget they that training. The their police, if you remember, <laughs> you know? the police oddly of a pastor, he collected, the pastor collected AK-47 from that pastor uh. medicine and went on pulpit with it. And <laughs> oddly was, left his own ammunition. Uh. So How much would he have given you? He left your power. He gave the pastor. To, yes. And yes. that was that Sunday and, costume. And, and whereas the, the pastor does not belong among people Permitted to carry that Kifu caliber of a weapon. Kifu it's not, you know, it's just part of what mm. is. is that really pastoring? Is that pastoring? Is it simply to stand before the congregation and be preaching politics? Is that is that pastoring? That's not pastoring. What is what is the what joggers, what the what they don't want to what what analogy were you trying to um to 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 to, to, to what 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 example are you trying to set? What argument pushed you to the point of using live uh, mm. 
I mean, uh, using uh, firearms. Yeah. When of, they could actually design something that looks like a, a gun. He was arrested. A, lo was arrested. a, a lot of a lot of pastors. No, that won't be the last. Oh, another one will still be. A lot of so-called like pastors have brought shame to the pulpit. It's so Honestly, terrible. it's so terrible. Highly so, politicized, highly so compromised. Especially during this election period. And it's, as we as bad. we commend the uh, uh, the officers that they've actually done well, mm. we, we have to also tell the police management those ones carrying bags for Madame, those ones carrying bags, those ones that will go and collect food for Madame. And is it? Um, I even still blame the <laughs> senior money. senior police. Uh, who are the people who posted them to go them. work with Madame? Every new IG will tell us they are withdrawing all the this people from the VIPs. Uh, from policemen from yes. VIPs. We have less than 400,000 policemen mm. in our country. But the ones who are guiding VIPs, they are probably oh. about half of the policemen that we have. Did they if I'm huh? a, a new, if I'm a Yahoo boy now or a cocaine no, you baron, yeah, you yes. can get, you can I'll get go to the I'll DPO, pay. I'll pay, and I'll do They will give you. If you have money, they will give you enough. And you know? the funny thing is that when you approach, I use it when to you, when you approach the police for a genuine case, maybe one day, because I have an experience. I wanted them to help me find a missing person. If you see, they would try to extort me. Money for five, money for six, yes, money for this, money you for that. Money, Eventually, they did, not, they did not help me. No, we, we, found, we found the person through another means. So we are sorry, while we are commending our officers, anyway, we, we, we don't have a police that is perfect. Mm. One good thing about us here is that where we need to praise you, we we'll praise you. Mm -hmm. Where we need to criticize you, we'll criticize you. Yeah. It is the nature of our job. Mm. We are not uh, going to be praising you blindly mm. when you mm. don't deserve it. Those who sure. deserve it, they will Those be praised. Have been so that's the thing. Is yes. we, so we are loyal to our so job. Congratulations to Egberto Kun, Olatunji Disu, Frank, Frank Kumba, and yes. those commissioner for the, yeah. of police. Uh, and even of them. this, uh, the police commissioner in Lagos, yeah. is one of the brightest officers. The new the yes, CPS. The, uh, you um, know, the uh, uh, principal uh, staff officer. PSO so to different, the IG. Different IGs. Different IGs. And this is what you are saying. If you are brilliant at your job, even when an IG is leaving, the, uh, the next one is thinking of making use of you. That's yeah. the way I had been reading about Owohunwa for some time. It's like an academic in the police. Mm. And you yeah. know, within a short time here, what he did, the way he quelled the fighting over Naira in Lagos. Mm -hmm. He got commendation. Mm -hmm. He got commendation. So we have people who are brilliant. Wherever you take them mm -hmm. to, they will excel. This mm -hmm. is what we are seeing. And there are still many bright people in the police yeah. that you don't yeah. even read about them. Mm -hmm. Definitely. People who are catching robbers, dealing with criminals. And as I've said repeatedly, mm -hmm. there are people in this police, this same police, that some bad people have given a bad name. This same police that you cannot bribe them. Hmm. Yeah. Do you know they, that they exist? Yeah. Ah. That, that you can't bribe them. Neither can you offer them women. Because even women, they will not take from you. They will not take money from you. In this same police. And for a man to escape from those two, eh? those two <laughs> vices. Uh -uh. <laughs> Do, well, well, if, if you do not humanize, hmm. you <laughs> do not uh, worship money. Hmm. You're already close to Aljana now. Honestly. You in fact, your, your, your staircase to Aljana is already paved in gold. Honestly. That's the way it is. <laughs> to escape those two things. <laughs> we know what <laughs> we are talking about. Oh. <laughs> to escape it. If you escape money, you will be, you will be a humanizer. <laughs> there are people like that. <laughs> if you don't like money that much, but they like women. There are some of them you can't bribe the boats, them boats. with some money. Most, some. Most annoying thing uh, but the, the, they have dangerous <laughs> is... You well, like combined, books. yes. That means you are Money. the most annoying thing. Mm. That means you are the definition of a man full of vices. Mm. If you if you actually have votes, <laughs> <laughs> if, yeah, yeah, trouble. Even the Bible, <laughs> even the Bible says some sins are greater than others. <laughs> the sin against the Holy Spirit, for example, is greater you, than others. You're etching us to another level. <laughs> no, let those pastors not think they are the only people <laughs> who know the Bible. <laughs>